I need to get the weapon fragment to Gaia to analyze. If we can replicate it, maybe we'll have a way to defeat the Zeniths. I should check on the clone, too. Burl, where's our guest? We're in the maintenance corridor below the control room. Okay. If you keep frowning that hard, it's I just don't get this last part. Aloy, you're back. Yeah. You mean, but isn't you? Guess this must be even stranger for you than a little. Varl said she may be able to help. Maybe. You said you Varl mentioned she was hurt. That was kind of you. I just hope she doesn't plan on... She looks like she's barely seen... What else have you been up... I've been studying Gaia's sea. I wanted to understand why one of them would do what they did. Imagine my surprise when I looked into this and found out it helped create all... Mach In a way, the Utaru owe Hephaestus our whole way of life, as well as our current... That's why we have to make Gaia whole... Varl looks... He's been obsessing over the data revealed to us by Poseidon. Just the other day, we read about mountains hiding deep underwater. If I understand correctly, Gaia said the flames they release come from like a heart. Be as always. Of course. I need to get me. Errand? Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, why wouldn't I be? Because there's two of me. Hey, there's two of you now. Well, at least you <laughs> seem to be handling it okay. <laughs> I wouldn't say that exactly, but I'm trying. How are you settling in? Yeah, Varl's been helping me get the lay of the land when he's not getting up. I don't know what makes him more nervous, that Gaia lady or our new Utaru friend. Well, what about the Vanguard? Aren't you supposed to be back east? Or I sent some of them back to Meridian with a message. I doubt Avad will mind me sticking around to help the savior of Meridian. Did you speak? She didn't really wake up till we brought her here. I, I thought it'd be better if Zoe and Var No use crowding someone when they're in a state. So Talana came by the base? Yeah, more like rushed through. I was hoping she'd stay for a drink at least. Only Karja I've ever met who's any fun. But it seemed like she had more pressing matters to attend to. I see Varl gave- well, It doesn't look as you know, fashionable on me, but- by the forge, the things I've been in, granted a lot of them are bad, you know, the old world ending. I still try to wrap my head around. I never really understood how you were ever able to find my sister back in the Sundom. And now I do. It makes me feel like I could be useful. It takes some time. What else have you been studying? Yeah, I've been looking into this uh, Vegas. Gaia showed us everything that happened when you went to get that. I mean, this Moreland guy seems pretty smart, though. Risking the Tanakh clan lands for a light show is a... Maybe I should check up on them at some point. Right. What are you working on? I'm still figuring out how to read stuff on this thing. Those two lovebirds over there have been... But to be honest, all the little symbols. But I'll get up to sp I guess you know what we're up... Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. When Varl first told me those bastards come from... I thought he'd eaten too many of those medicinal berries. Yeah, but I've gotten used to seeing impossible things. I just wish they weren't always trying to kill us. Yeah, you... I have to get... Don't go causing... Oh. Looks like someone's made this space their own. I see you found Varl and Zoe's room, Aloy. Oh. I believe they wanted private accommodations. I see. It looks like one of the Utaru's land gods. Like the one we killed in the sacred cave. I'm not sure I'll ever fully understand, but... Seeing something that represents life and prosperity turned into a weapon... It couldn't have been easy for so. Anybody seen one of my... Is around? Why don't you check the cash? Looks like some of the holograms are working now. I have repurposed the displays to track Regala's activity in the region. A useful war map.
Aloy. Glad you made it back okay. She panicked after waking up and stumbled down here. I thought it best to wait for you. I'll talk to her. Hello? It's, uh... It's Beta, right? My name's Aloy. What's wrong? Is it your injury? Simulacrum withdrawal syndrome. I... don't understand. Sudden removal of a neurologically integrated data device. The brain, especially the cerebellum, goes into a kind of... sensory freefall. Everything real feels... unreal. Distant. Is there anything that can help? Do you have a focus to spare? It's, it's primitive, but I can make it work. Yeah. Booting up. Oh, robot. <laughs> so, uh, Aloy, I suppose you want information about you and the Zeniths? Yeah. Why are they here? What do they want? How did they get you? But let's start at the beginning. I'm guessing they faked the destruction of their ship a thousand years ago. That seems consistent with their behavior. They wouldn't want to be followed. So far, Zenith established a colony world after all. Yes, for a few hundred years, but it didn't last. Some sort what? of natural disaster rendered it uninhabitable. Okay, no. so... The descendants of Far Zenith escaped a dying planet. And now they want to claim Earth for themselves? Not their descendants. What? Not their descendants. It, it, it's them. The same ones who left Earth a thousand years ago. What? You didn't know? How can they still be alive? They don't even look... What did they do to themselves? I believe it's a combination of pharmaceutical, cellular treatments, and technological implants. And, and you? Does that mean that you're... I'm not like them. I was made. On the way to Earth. On the ship. I spent years studying in my training interface. All so that I could serve my function. Access and control of the terraforming system. But why? What do the Zeniths want with it? When I discovered the Zero Dawn system had disseminated into its subcomponents, I thought my purpose was to fix it. But I don't think the Zeniths want that at all. I think they want to wipe Earth clean and start over. Shucks. So the Zeniths want to exterminate life on Earth. That's what Gaia and I concluded too. But why? Why kill everyone just to take over? When they took me on missions with them, I saw how they... butchered. The tribal people we encountered. They didn't seem to care about a rejuvenated Earth, so... I concluded that they must want a hard reboot of the system. Then they can redesign it to be exactly what they want. Mass extinction for their own comfort? Who thinks like that? Well, without their Gaia kernel, they'll have a hard time doing that. The Zeniths needed Elizabeth's gene print to access Zero Dawn facilities. So they made you. Trained you. And you went along with it? They told me I was born to interface with the Zero Dawn system. When we reached Earth, I pieced together what must have happened to Gaia and her subordinate functions. That's when I started to realize I wasn't meant to fix Gaia. That they must have made me so I could do what their remote extinction signal failed to do. Reboot Earth for their own benefit. So you know about the extinction signal? It was speculation, but the only logical conclusion why Gaia suddenly self-destructed after operating efficiently for centuries. Gaia would have only undertaken such a desperate course of action if it had detected a threat to life on Earth that was more dangerous than ceasing function altogether. I should have realized that she would also order the recreation of Elizabeth Sobek to rebuild her. Yeah, well, surprise. <laughs> so we're dealing with the same far zenith people who once lived on Earth. What else do you know about them? They were some of the most affluent and powerful people on Earth. They controlled almost every major resource, every industry. Gerard commands them. He's the one who decided to set up a base. 
The others, Eric, Tilda, Verbena, they resent his authority over them, but in the end, they always do what he says. Eric, he's the one I fought back in the Hades Proving Lab. He enjoys hurting people. Yeah, I know. <sighs> you mentioned the Zenus set up a base here on Earth. Where is it? Son. Off the coast, I think. Whenever I had to go on missions, I was transported inside of a Spectre drone. I couldn't see anything outside. But I did overhear the Zeniths talking about it once. They were discussing setting up a perimeter energy shield to repel the local fauna. I'm certain they have other security measures. Spectre patrols, machine lures. It, it must be impregnable. What's inside the base? Launch facilities so they can shuttle back and forth to their ship in orbit. Plus infrastructure to gather materials and fabricate anything they need. Are there more Zeniths than the ones you met? I'm not sure. I, I suppose there must be more of them in the base or back on the ship. For all I know, there could be more of them out in space. Are there survivors of the colony? Shit. You said the Zenith's colony in the Sirius system was destroyed. What happened? All I was ever told was that a natural disaster forced them to leave Sirius. I've speculated that it was an extrasolar object or a cataclysmic seismic event. Or maybe even an abnormally violent coronal mass ejection from Sirius A. The Zeniths never told you any details. They said the only thing that mattered was that they survived. First Earth, a thousand years ago, and then Sirius. Guess they survived old age, too. How did you escape the Zeniths? Before the Hades Proving Lab, I never thought I'd get away from them. Even if I were to run, I'd never survive on my own in the wilds. Then I saw you. And I thought that maybe you could help me. So when the Zeniths pinpointed Eleuthia's location in the biomedical research facility, I saw an opportunity. You said you saw an opportunity to escape when you went to capture Eleuthia. What did you do, exactly? Whenever I was taken out on a mission to recover a subordinate function, only one of the Zeniths would go with me. The one the rebels killed. Outside the facility. Verbena's dead? How did they bypass her shield? I'm looking into it. But you were talking about your escape? Well, when it was time to use the Zenith's transmitter to send Eleuthia back to base, I also sent the encrypted transmission. Then I distracted Verbena long enough to seal myself in the ectogenic chamber, altering the facility's log so it appeared that there were only 236 containers. And the Gaia root kernel? I told them I could capture Luthia faster if I had it with me, and they believed me. Well done. You said you were born on the way to Earth. In an artificial womb, I'm guessing? The Zeniths had an ectogenic chamber aboard the ship. An updated version of the one you found me in. They must have used a stored sample of Elizabeth's DNA. I doubt Elizabeth would have let them take her DNA. Do you know how they got it? That wasn't part of the archive I was allowed to access. You said you spent years studying in a training interface. Was this archive you mentioned part of that? But only the parts I was permitted to access. Aristotle and Aspasia, the avatars of the archive, would assign me learning modules and evaluate my progress. Wait, those names? They were designed to be the virtual guides for the Apollo database. Before Ted Farrell purged it. The Zeniths have a copy. So it still exists. And you got to learn from it. Only what was deemed pertinent to the mission. If I requested information outside of my parameters, my tutors would deny it. To have all that knowledge... ...just out of reach... ...must have been frustrating. All right, I think that's enough for now. Do you want to come upstairs, or...? So how long? You know, your, your, your plan. How long before Gaius fabricated a machine army to defeat the Zenus? How did you know optimal strategy, so? Well, I still have to get two more subordinate functions before Gaius powerful enough to absorb Hephaestus. What? You don't have Hephaestus already? 
guy is still figuring out how to capture it. It's not confined to a single to a single location. Of course not. <laughs> you didn't even know who the Zeniths really are. You were supposed to be further along by now. Coming here was a mistake. They're going to find me. They're going to find this place and take me back. This was all for nothing. They're not going to find us. Guy is using Minerva to mask our location. What difference does it make? You're too far behind. We're never going to beat them. Everything. Everyone. I'm going to die. Hey. Calm down. You're here now, right? So is there anything you can do to help? I have certain knowledge sets. And given your state of progress, expertise you probably lack. Geoengineering, of course. Computer science, physics, biology, chemistry. Okay. okay. Nice. Well, see if you can do something with that. Talk to Gaia. I'll check on you later. How'd it go? Her injury's not that bad, but I think she regrets coming here. Feeling might be mutual. Hmm. I'll come back later and talk to her. See if I can learn anything. I should get the weapon fragment to Gaia. Brattles of Echoes. Apparently it tastes worse the longer it takes to be delivered. Or something like that. Maybe you can find the recipe? I think it was just flat bread. With cheese. And some sauce. I like it already. Hey. Nothing some rest can't take. Are you okay? Just trying to take it once. Fair enough. If you... How's everyone? I tried explaining what a clone is to Aaron. Then Zoe said something about two trees coming from one seed. That's... <laughs> I'm guessing Talana didn't stay for... You got that right. Makes you wonder what this Amadis guy did to grab her... Whatever it was, she didn't... Must be quite a... I guess she'll tell us when she's ready. How's everyone handling their focus? And we all have our difficult moments. But I'm hoping Osiram stubbornness prevails. How's everyone doing? Just taking it all... I see everyone settled. Zoe's planning on bringing all kinds of plants in here. Says a home should always spring with life. I asked Aaron to help find some. I think he'd rather stick his head into a snap mall. Still, it's not a bad idea. So? Yes, training. Look, she reads glyphs faster than I can already. I'd be a fool to... Of course. <laughs> you guys reading something over... We just finished going through all the logs you collected back in Nora territory. And All Mother Mountain. It's hard to imagine that my ancestors were trapped inside, without the knowledge from Apollo to guide them. Thanks to Ted Farrow. Yeah. I wonder how it must have felt when they were... The world must have seemed... Not to mention terrifying. They weren't much more than kids. And they became an entire tribe. It's good to see you and Zoe enjoying your... We're learning a lot. I've actually been looking through the data to find ideas for a gift. And to thank her for helping me study the glyphs. Something from the old world that she... Instead, I found out they gave each other stuffed... If you ask me, stuffing a dead animal with... Anything, really, doesn't... Maybe Gaia can help you find something else. <laughs> Stop, I am... Looks like I was wrong, but their ship didn't explode on its way to Sirius. And we saw how they lied about creating a better future at their launch facility. Guess they lied about what happened to their ship, but still... A tribe settling amongst the stars. I couldn't put a single dent in their shields, Varl. That one zenith almost killed me. That didn't stop you from resurrecting Gaia. Won't stop us from using Hephaestus against them. Let's hope that's enough. I should get back. I'll keep an eye on Beta. Make Okay. Aloy, I see we have a new guest. So now we know the origin of the transmission. Yeah, I also recovered this. The weapon it was part of somehow stripped a zenith of its shield, but it malfunctioned and blew up. 
If we can recreate the weapon and improve it, maybe we'll gain the upper hand on the Xenos. A moment. I will scan it. Complete. By combining the results with data from your focus, I can infer that the weapon was highly advanced, comparable to Zenith technology. But not how it worked. Whoa. Did the explosion corrupt the data? It was only a catalyst. The moment the weapon malfunctioned, it appears a command executed to purge all data within its core. Ostensibly, oh, yeah. this was to prevent the weapon's secrets from falling into enemy hands. Whoever designed this weapon knew how to cover their tracks. Silence. Silence. Based on <laughs> your data that. on him, that is my conclusion as well. And he's not going to cooperate with us. Well, it was worth a shot. But that's not all. The Zenus got Aluthia, along with Artemis and Apollo. That is unfortunate. However, our original plan remains unchanged. The two remaining subordinate functions should increase my heuristic processing density enough to absorb Hephaestus. Right. One problem at a time. Well, I guess I better get back out there. I wish you luck on your search. Right. <laughs> <laughs>